Kids will play an important role in helping young cancer patients. Four girls spend the past few weeks training to perform at one of the largest dance competitions in the state of Nebraska. But it's a performance that's for much more than a trophy. 3 News Now reporter Sydney Gray is live from Nebraska Met with this story. Sydney. Hey, good morning, Emily. Well, as you said it, these girls are performing for much more than a trophy, and honestly, they're thinking of others before themselves. Now, these girls have endured more than the average adult. Some of them have even had cancer, but in the midst of all of that, they're thinking of other patients who are still in the hospital for treatment right now. And the girls were all patients at Nebraska Medicine at one point, and although this group is in better health now, they remember what it's like to be confined to a hospital bed. So with that in mind, it's it's a Child's Life Foundation partnered with the Vintage Ballroom Company, and together they'll they'll work to raise money to purchase gifts, games, and books for other children. The girls' doctors will dance with them this weekend at the Nebraska Dance Festival. It gives us a chance to do something outside of the hospital and, and make us, you know, of all the treatments and chemo and things, this is a chance to do something normal. And the girls' dance instructor says taking dance lessons gives the girls the opportunity to move and ex exercise their bodies for the first time um, since many of them began treatment nearly a year ago. And the dance festival is tomorrow night at the Hilton Inn Doubletree downtown where you can go and support the girls and their cause. Live in Nebraska Medicine, Sydney Gray, 3 News Now, this morning.